Hi, it's Matt from Excel Pro Tech, and today I want to show you something a bit different. What I'm going to be doing, this is a Raspberry Pi Zero, and I'm going to be attaching the GPIO header, which are, uh, let me get it in focus, which are these little pins, and we're going to be soldering them onto this Raspberry Pi Zero. So um, this, is, um, this is something that I've just bought, uh, arrived today, so I just thought um, for something a bit different, I thought I'd, uh, I'd show you the process in soldering this on to the, to the board. Okay, so, and I'm going to be showing you the, the best way as well, because sure, you can just stick that in and then solder it, but the problem is... Let's just uh, get that a bit closer to the monitor. The problem is, what you'll find is if you heat the pins a bit too long, is that these pins here will start to bend, they, they won't be straight. So um, the best way to do it, you've probably guessed by now, is to use a breadboard. Plonk these the GPO, GPIO header down into the breadboard and that's going to basically act to hold it in place and our pins are going to be nice and straight when we finish. Okay, there we go. Um, I'll just pop my soldering iron on and get my some solder. Hopefully, all being well, we should be just be able to bounce that. On there. So yeah, ideally what we want to do is get this as straight as possible. And my soldering iron should be nicely up to speed now. Get the edge. Okay, so what I'm going to do is going to go around the four corners. So I am going to take you through the whole of this. Um, th there are a few videos on this on YouTube. They'll, they'll speed it up. They'll just they'll just do like four pins and then they'll leave it. But uh, yeah, I want to show you the whole thing from start to finish. So uh, you know, I will uh, I will go around and uh, and do it all for you. So you can see basically the process involved. and see my crap soldering skills. Oh. So those of you who are regulars who have noticed that I haven't done a video in a while, I apologise. <laughs> it's been a while. Um, just things in life in general has been been a bit busy. Trying to sort st stuff out.
when you are soldering this as well just be careful because there are lots and lots um you know it's it's a compact board i mean you don't need to worry about components on this side but just be wary of the there are lots of traces on this side of the board so if you if you keep your soldering iron on too long you are going to oh, you will probably burn through the traces and then you will have a dead raspberry pi probably a bit too much solder on that bit there but never mind mm, probably again on that one Just be wary as well. You obviously saw what I did there. I bridged two pins together. Um, if you do manage to do that, don't worry. Just uh, just put your soldering iron on it. And it, you know, the, the solder ball should go into your... Basically, the solder should be drawn to your soldering iron. That's it. Do do sort of check um, as you're going round that you haven't done that. You know, there's nothing there. There are voltages that run through this uh, GPIO header, so just be very careful. not to bridge any pins okay so we are done let me just show you in a close-up they are all done um, yeah I'm not claiming that to be the best soldering job in the world ever but uh, you know all of our pins should be straight I will just take it out turn this on around for a minute And again, just double check. Oh, you know what? I've just spotted one that isn't quite uh, quite right. Can you spot it? Uh, we've got one there that's not. Uh, um, can you see that? No, we've got one there that's not quite right. Uh, there's one there as well that's not quite right either. Let's just. that Right, there we go. More happier with that. So, yeah, here we go. There we go. That's. Is my attempt at soldering the Raspberry Pi Zero. And as you can see, when I take it out of the breadboard, all of my pins are nicely straight. There's no bent pins. I think that the problem is when you are soldering these things, um, it's only a little bit of... Let's just bring that into view properly. You know, it's only a little bit of plastic that's holding in those pins. So when you warm the pins up, the plastic's going to get hot as well. And it basically it melts through and then you end up with pins that are uneven length. You know, you can see there it's all flat. Um, all straight, all flat. 
and that's the reason that I use the breadboard with when doing that. So, right, <laughs> I'm going to now experiment with this Raspberry Pi Zero. Um, it's just one of the things that um, that I've been doing in the store is is getting more things that are associated with technology and uh, developers, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. So the Raspberry Pi sort of stuff is is new into the store. Um, I've been getting a lot of these. I've just ordered a load of these GPIO headers. Those are coming in, and there's loads of accessories. I should have a case for this as well that is coming in. And hopefully there'll be a bit more, a few more projects. What I'll do is, is try and get it some projects together, um, and show you me working through those projects and how it, how the Raspberry Pi works. So, thank you very much for watching. My name is Matt from Excel Pro Tech. I'll see you on the next video. Thank you. Bye bye.